going to talk about product of powers say we have 2 cube times 2 squared so to simplify product of powers meaning powers of the same base we just rewrite the base the given common base then add the exponents so 2 cube times 2 squared is equal to 2 to the fifth when we say 2 cube this simply means 2 times 2 times 2 okay and 2 square is 2 times 2 so when we say 2 cube our base here is 2 what is base base is the repeated factor in the product and our exponent is 3 and what is exponent the exponent tells us how many times the base is used as a factor let's say this base which is 2 it is used 3 times so 1 2 3 so our exponent is 3 so 2 cube is the same as 2 times 2 times 2 and 2 squared is 2 times 2 so what is 2 times 2 times 2 this is 8 and 2 times 2 is 4 then 8 times 4 is 32 how about 2 to the fifth this simply means 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 so let us let's get the product 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is 8 times 2 is 16 times 2 we have 32 let's have another given say we have x squared times x so our base is x common base so x squared times x is equal to x cubed so given the same base we have x so we just rewrite x then our exponents are 2 and here we have 1 as the exponent so 2 plus 1 is 3 so x squared times x is just equal to x cubed let us check let's say we have x is equal to 3 so if x is 3 so we have 3 squared times 3 what is 3 squared 3 times 3 is 9 times 3 is 27 how about x cubed let's say x is 3 so that is 3 cubed and what is 3 cubed simply means 3 times 3 times 3 is also 27 another given we have 5x squared times 3x cubed so here we have 5 and 3 as our numerical coefficients so what shall we do with this numerical coefficient so here we're going to get first the product of 5 and 3 so 5 times 3 is 15 then x squared times x cubed we have x to the 5th 
5 because we add 2 and 3 so 2 plus 3 is 5 so our product is 15 x to the fifth another if we have x cubed y squared times x y to the fourth so we get the product first of x cubed and x so x cubed times x is x to the fourth then y squared times y to the fourth is y to the sixth so we have the x to the fourth y to the sixth